President Akufuado has reiterated his commitment to seeing to the completion of the National Cathedral at the climax of the Bible reading marathon organized by the Board of Trustees at the construction site. The president said he will continue to work with them to see his vision come to life. The Bible reading marathon was climaxed with a thanksgiving and worship service. It also marked the start of the countdown to the project completion. Ultimately, our goal was to focus attention in the essence of the National Cathedral project and this Bible Museum on the one hand and promote Christian unity among the various denominations in our country. I also indicated that the cathedral project will be linked to the Beyond the Return initiative, alluding to the returnees and the rebuilding of the temple as in Ezra. There have been several pushbacks against the National Cathedral project, but the executors are beginning the year with renewed hope and strategy. Essentially, uh, we believe that at the heart of our strategy, is to raise a million Ghanaians who will give us 100 cities a month. If we can do that for just two years, we will have the capital resources for the cash flow as well as have some for endowment. Just a million people. We are supposed to be 31 million citizens, 21 million of whom are Christians. Uh, if the church leaders stand with us on this project, we can easily raise a million people who will give us 100 cities. President Ekufado, who made a personal donation of 100,000 cities, says he will continue to work with the board to realize his vision. I'm therefore committed to working with the board of trustees to ensure the completion of this project to the glory of God and the edification of our nation and all our people. I'm grateful, very grateful, to all of you for your presence here. May the God of heaven strengthen our hand on us as we rise to build the cathedral to his glory and by making a donation of 100,000 CDs to the project. With a vision unchanged, the historic project, according to the president, would not only be a rallying point for Ghanaians, but also serve as a tourist site attracting millions.